We're so glad you've been able to join us here. We have united in the presence of God to witness the joining together of this man and this woman in the holy bond of marriage. The sacred relationship was established by God in creation, and it's commanded in Scripture to be held in honor by all people. It's at once one of human beings' greatest responsibilities and also one of our greatest blessings. I remember the night Brett met Jenna as we were at the ranch, a local bar, country bar with live music. Brett and I sat in the car and out walked Jenna, this tall brunette with the eyes he couldn't ignore. Nothing in the world could have stopped him from rolling down the window and singing. How come all the pretty girls like you are taking, baby? on our wedding day. <laughs> I love you so much and have been thinking about you all this week. We are at our finish line about to start a new race together. Let's cut a rug and have a ball today. Love, Mr. McMahon. To my groom on our wedding day. Today, I finally get to marry my best friend. Today, I get to show you my pretty dress, tell you how much I love you in front of everyone. We know and leave this beautiful place with the cutest, silliest, most amazing husband. Today is going to be the best day ever. So fast. Jenna's the kind of girl you want to watch longer but grew too fast. Brett's the kind of boy that you want on your home team fast. Greek language where that's written in effect what it's saying is Greek says love is never in the past tense. There's never a time when it's gone because true love never fails. And that's the sort of gift that you offer. Jenna, you bring out the best in me. You are my encourager and endurer through all things. My lover through highs and lows and barometer throughout life. I love you deeply. Brett, you have taught me what the best kind of love looks like. You are so selfless, passionate, thoughtful, generous, and kind. You're the most dependable person I've ever known and you always make me feel so safe. I'll bring you gummy cubs, goldfish, and wine. Kiss you until you smile. And I can't wait to hear your shower concerts booming through our home and to floss together every single night. I'll take your tender heart and treat it carefully because it strives for peace and harmony and softens mine. I'll try to apologize and resolve conflict quickly because I know there's a bigger picture and what makes you happy truly makes me smile. I love you, Brett Thomas, and I cannot wait to call you my husband. I Brett take you Jenna. I Brett take you Jenna to be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold from this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. Better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. Excluding all others. Excluding all others. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. With God as my witness. With God as my witness. I give you my pledge. I give you my pledge. 
Now you've chosen to seal these vows by the giving and receiving of rings. And the ring forms a perfect circle without a beginning or end. And in that sense, it's a symbol of eternity and indicates the duration of the pledge that you're making. Brett, repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my vow. As a symbol of my vow. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I will honor you. I will honor you. Woo! So now by the authority invested in me as a minister of the gospel and in accordance with the laws of the state of California, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. The way you've, walked, you've blossomed with Brett by your side has been such a privilege to watch. Um, and then your role as Ellie's auntie has been so vital and precious to me. I've cherished our friendship and our sistership, and I'm so excited to now journey with you now as married women. I just literally could not be happier for you both. So let's cheers to the bride and groom, to a lifetime of health, happiness, Packers wins, and love. Cheers. Yes. Jenna, I promise you, whatever Brett fails to do, you most certainly will never be bored. I love you both and congratulations. I'm ecstatic you decided to change your last name. Regardless of what this life holds and salvation aside, you are my crowning jewel, the helper God graciously supplied. I love you so much, my Jenna Buck.